I messed up. Let me explain. Over the past year and a bit, we've been opening up first edition Absolute Power Force booster boxes live here on the channel in booster box breaks where some of you guys will buy packs for me to open on live stream and I will send you the pulls. But these weren't just any booster boxes. These booster boxes were actually from a sealed case, which I have right here. As you can see right there, it says 12, if it can focus, 12 Absolute Power Force booster boxes made in Belgium. So we open box after box, and we get down to what I believe are the last two boxes in the case. What I believe, we'll get to that later. So with that, I feel confident in saying this. And that's why I can guarantee one of these first edition Absolute Power Force booster boxes contains a 13 year old Ghost Rare Yu-Gi-Oh card. For those of you who don't know, the ratios for Yu-Gi-Oh 5Ds state that one in every 288 packs, or generally one in every case, contains a ghost rare. So with this information that only two boxes were left, they got scooped up pretty quickly and we cracked them on live stream. Well, let's just say that little short, that guarantee did not age well. And uh, instead of explaining everything out, I'm actually just gonna replay the live stream right now so you guys can kind of get a general idea of what's going on. Today, we have a new member of the Ghost Mo gang because these are the last two boxes of the sealed case, folks. Now, folks, there's only one rule for this opening. When we pull that ghost rare, because we will pull that ghost rare, jack it off, I mean, jack it up in the comments for our guy Jack Atlas here. So if you're watching this video later on, we are gonna be opening up one box, and then if you do see a synchro, you're gonna see a little edit. No tomfoolery is gonna be going on here. As we do for every live stream, we will tuck away that synchro, and then come to the end of the video, we reveal all of the synchros together. Actually, almost 14-year-old set here. I was gonna say nearly 13-year-old, but almost a 14-year-old set. Five Ds, it's when your boy was Still running around the dual scene a little bit at his locals. He still does it. <laughs> running scraps. And okay, our first hollow cards of consonants. Alrighty, no synchros yet. This is actually kind of uh, opposite to our last opening where we were pulling like only synchros. It's just got to give us that suspense ammo. Here we go. Panda Borg. Just building that suspense ammo, baby. And whoa, did I forget to do the card trick or is it different here? Well, it might be different if a hollow's there. I can't, I forgot. Oh, there we go. Our first ultra rare, Kwaki Miru Urnite. Oil man, in former spider. Absolute power force is awesome, Juan. It's uh, definitely, definitely got a place in my heart now. It was actually one of my least favorite sets before I started opening this case, but by the end of it, come to love it. Unless we just don't pull a ghost rare, right? Call of the Reaper. Temple of the Sun. Spider's Lair. If you notice too, face cam isn't turning off here during this live stream because we've got a, a new method. So <laughs> that's a little bit of a win. And do we have something here? We do a Gravekeeper's Visionary. And I want to say this is a very nice super rare. A little red dot there. That's something that uh, indicates that it is European. Can we pull this ghost rare so I could be European my pants? Come on. Let's go. Where are you, buddy? I know you're in here somewhere. It will be majestic. It will be red. I promise you that. Tuner's scheme. This is a, a scheme right here. Where are the damn synchros? To not pull one synchro so far is kind of glitchy. Ooh, we have something here, it looks like. We do have a cards of consonants. Okay, folks, we have three packs left. We still haven't pulled an ultimate. We still haven't pulled a secret. What is going on? Is this one of those wacky tobacky manufacturing... 5D's errors. What is going on? I am losing it. I'm speechless. Ritual cage and a reptilian rage. Last two packs. No ultimate rare. No secret rare left. Uh, has been pulled. What is going on here, folks? No hesitation indeed. He's ready. I'm ready. 
Magic Hole Golem, Panda Borg, Destruction Potion, Cyber Dragon Zwei, and it's a super rare. What the heck is going on? No, do we have a wacky tabacky opening for one of the? La this is this is. But here we go, guys. Last pack magic. Sniff for good luck. Come on. It would all make up for it though, wouldn't it? No secret, no ultimate. Would you replace it for a ghost rare, Brandon? Would you? Oh, there's only one way to find out. Serpent suppression. I'll have to suppress my rage if... Oh. My. Goodness. We're just gonna go ahead and do exactly what I said, and we're gonna sleeve that up because we have a potential last pack magic for Brandon here. I see the light. Jehovah's lost there. Hope is literally <laughs> lost. We still haven't seen anything yet. We still do not know what it is. It could be a friggin' ultra rare. We do not know what that card is. Now is the point where we crack open this next box and we do the same thing if we see another synchro. Here we go. Box number two, numero dos, absolute power force. Let's rev it up. Let's jack it up. Those are the rules. Whoa, I, it's not even like on purpose. I just started speed running it just cause I'm kind of like, I'm a little, a little excited now. I kind of want to get to it too. All right, guys, here we go. Temple of the sun. We will have a new ghost Mo member today. Ghost Mo gang member. I promise you that. It's a Yugi Mo guarantee. Okay, I saw a, uh, I saw a hollow coming up. I was like, Whoa. synchro. Uh, fiendish chain. Actually, a very nice super rare. It was worth like forty bucks at one point. I think a ghost rare will be pulled today. We will have a new member of the Ghost Mo gang. That is a Yu Gi Mo guarantee. I'm just gonna keep saying it every pack until it happens, and then it's gonna look like I called it. <laughs> And, oh, whoa, I was not expecting that. A Cactus Bouncer. Okay, this tough little dude, you don't want to mess with him. Cactus Bouncer, that is jokes. A secret rare Cactus Bouncer, nonetheless. That snuck up on me. Uh, you can get an Ultra and an Ultimate that are the same card, but you can get the Ultra, ultra Rare and an Ultimate Rare of it. So, some people like that, some people don't like that. Personally, not so much, but yeah, I like that's what I did kind of like about GX where they mixed it up. They didn't have like ultra rares or ultra, ult, they did have like only ultimate rares as as ultis. But anywho, continuing on, we're looking to see some white glory here today. It sounds it's beginning to sound a little racist. It has nothing to do with race. It's it's getting synchros. I don't know if I'm gonna make that my slogan anymore. I see the white. That's we're tiptoeing now. We're. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, oh no, I can't say that. I gotta cut that out. Oh, that's that's too far. I'm all about fun and games here, but that's that's too far. <laughs> Go darts. All right, Shredder. How am I gonna make a video of this? I forgot I have to record it and release it to the to the masses as a normal Yu Gi Oh video. What's up, by the way? If you're watching, make sure you come check out the live streams where this happened live. That's usually how live streams go. Anyways, um, next card here. Do we have a holo? We do. Oh. Synchro control. Interesting little little holo there. I always love synchro summoning. Like I said, multiple times. I've always been my favorite like card type or monster type. All right, here we go. Reptilian Naga. Reptilian Vosky. And a saber hole. Right in the saber hole. Pow, right in the saber hole. I'm a girl with a boy's name. That That's a first time, Tommy. That's the first time I've ever heard a Tommy girl. Tomboy, you see, whoa, you see what I just did there? Whoa, just blew my own mind. All right, <laughs> Rose Fairy, Layer Wire, Magical Golem, Unicycular, Visor, <laughs> Oh, Visor, Ding Dong Damalu, we might have a little competition here on our hands. Last pack of that half magic. 
Ding Dong, Dimalu, Yu-Gi-Mo has a synchro for you. You see, yeah, yours was way better than mine. I don't know what I said there. Let's replace that in post. Inverse universe. Nature's reflection. Reptilian servant. Spider lair. Destruction potion. And do we have something here? We do! This is my favorite super from the set for sure. Super nimble mega hamster. All right, after a few technical issues. Should probably just do wired connection when we stream. Keep it safe. Especially if we're recording anything after. And a draconic god. Forgotten Temple of the Deep. The Deep. The Boys. Anybody watch The Boys? Great show. Reptilian Servant. Spider's Lair. Ooh. Cyber Dragon Zwei. And Zwei think this might be an ultimate rare or has a chance to be because it is a ritual monster. And there is only one ritual monster in this set. That monster is Ganondorf himself. And it is the ultimate rare Ganondorf! Are you kidding me? The King of Destruction has been pulled. So, we now have our ulti pull. Okay, one of these boxes is in on the wacky tabacky. A beautiful ulti indeed. Okay, yeah, we do have the little ultimate rare box, and actually we have the stars and the effect box, or sorry, circles also. So this, unfortunately, PSA does ding that. I don't know why, like they should consider certain defects with certain cards. I don't know, I went to grab another one of these. I wanted to grab a hard sleeve. Where's the hard sleeve? Have we pulled an ultra rare yet? I don't, maybe we we haven't pulled an ultra. So we, we should get at least one or maybe two ultra rares. Let's see, let's see if we can give us a little synchro scare maybe. A little suspense of synchro bro -mo. Can we do it again? Can we add to the fun today? Evil Blast. All right. All righty. All righty, ladies and gentlemen. Are we good? I don't want to like... And the ghost rare! <laughs> it like... <laughs> <laughs> fucking gets all choppy and glitchy. Yeah, and so uh, we pulled the ghost rare and it was absolute shit footage and can't use any of it. And Shield Worm and a variety comes out. Uh, which ultimate rare is the best from Absolute Power Force? I would say it's the uh, Battle Fader we pulled last time. Two packs to go. Two synchros, e one synchro each. Who will get it? There's only one way to find out. Power Invader. Whoop. Call of the Reaper. Calling me a ghost rare. Where is it? Oh. My goodness. That one's right at the back. So, <laughs> about having only one synchro. Oh, Nelly. Wow. Things just got interesting. Keep that in mind. We have yet to pull an ultra rare, right? No ultra. No ultra. That being said, that could be a second ultimate rare. We've seen crazier shit. We've seen stuff like the last pack, or last box, literally. Either doesn't have an ultimate rare, doesn't have a secret rare in it. Was this the juiced box? Is this the one? There's <sighs> only one way to find out, folks. Here we go. Last pack. Ma Jack. You know the rules, folks. Here it comes. The synchro reveals. The only rule? Jack. It up yu gi and having the ghost rare in the last box name a more iconic duo i see you gummy bears i know what you're saying it happened with the with the raw it happened i'm pretty sure with the with the uh with the unlimited absolute power force will it happen with this first edition european print absolute power force box break case break here it is folks we come to a close Twenty five hundred. By my calculation, that ain't strong enough, folks. That ain't strong enough. Moon Dragon Quila. Okay. Moon Dragon Quila. I'm pretty sure we've pulled like a bunch of Sun Dragon Inties, but I don't remember pulling a bunch of the old Moon Opposite. We've seen it before. I've pulled a Secret Rare and a Ghost Rare in the same box. 
Is this Visor Dez holding that same secret? Here we go, folks. That ain't strong enough. That ain't strong enough. That is a drill warrior, though. Does that mean we literally just last pack magic this? I mean, we had a, we were able to deduce a little ourselves. I was in the back of my head too. I'm like, well, technically, if this guy pulled the secret, technically the ghost should replace the secret. Ladies and gentlemen, this should be a ghost rare first edition majestic red dragon. There's only one thing to do. What? What? What just happened? How is that possible? It's a full case. There's no way. There's no way. A full case? It's not guaranteed with the Euro product? That's never happened. I don't think there's been a bigger disappointment. I, I quit, guys. I quit streaming. That's it. Didn't TSX1 buy one of the booster boxes? He has it. He has the ghost. He literally has the ghost. You're right. He didn't do that stream. He didn't do that stream. You're right. Yo. Quick, buy it back from him. But I thought I saw him open what that box on Whatnot, on one of his Whatnot streams. When I sold it to him, he mentioned, I'm going to be opening it up in about a month on Whatnot. I saw what in the stream scheduled, and I saw him opening up Absolute Power Force there. So I put two and two together. I figured, oh, okay, he opened the box. He told me he, oh, he didn't tell me. He didn't pull the Ghost Rare. So with that information, like I said, I felt pretty confident in saying these are the last two boxes in the case. But then Toy Center just had me thinking. So I asked Sam. I just said, hey, was that the booster box that I sold you recently that you opened up on Whatnot? And he mentioned... It was a box that I sold him, but it was one I sold him, I would say, over a year ago. So I sold him two Absolute Power Force booster boxes. The first one, I don't believe, was from the same case. So I asked him, I said, hey, he said he still has that one sealed, the, the last one from the case that I, I know is from the case. So I asked him, hey man, like, do you still have it? Are you willing to sell it or something? Because I feel terrible. Again, I assumed, I didn't assume, I had... A pretty good feeling uh, seeing what I saw that that was that was the box right he's a busy dude though he doesn't always really have time for little yu gi 4k subs so I've tried to contact him he again he did let me know he has the box but if you're watching this Sam and you're willing to sell that last box please let us know or if you're you're close to Sam reach out to him DM him let us know to get back to us again though it is his box I sold it to him before I made any guarantees. So in all, it is actually his decision, obviously what he wants to do with the box. If he would sell it to us, to the, to the last guys who bought the last two boxes, that'd be unreal. I told them I would compensate and I would buy them a couple packs from it. And if not, we could find another way to work it out. But that is the story so far. Um, thankfully, those dudes who did buy the boxes, Yu-Gi-Oh! Cash Out and uh, Brendan, they were very understanding, unlike these people who decided to voice their opinions when, number one, they bought a total of zero packs from these box breaks, and uh, number two, probably have never opened a Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's box, let alone ca multiple cases in their life, two of them which were on camera here, and we did pull Ghost Rares. So, again, it's 
I, I've heard here say, I've actually heard from people, reputable sources, that apparently the Euro boxes might not have a guaranteed ghost rare. But we cannot confirm that yet because the last box from this case has not been opened. So again, Sam, if you're watching this, reach out to me. If I could just even be a part of that box break, just so I could just tell all the haters, you know, what's up. Again, it was, a, it was a pretty understandable misunderstanding from my end when I did see him open up a box and I just didn't realize it was the one I sold him previously. So with that being said, this saga is not over. Stay tuned. Hopefully again, hopefully he reaches out to us. But until then, take her easy haters.